Tonight's production of The Music Man will be presented in two acts with one 15-minute intermission. This is a live theater experience and the actors and musicians deserve your kind respect throughout the show. With that in mind, at this time, we would like you to turn off all cell phones or put them on silent mode. Restrooms are immediately outside of the theater to your left. Concessions are being sold tonight by the NHS PTSA, which are supporting some of the funds for the show tonight. And now, The Music Man. Well, you always feel nervous. It's like saying, I'm going to send out an invitation to a party, but I don't know if anybody's going to show up. I mean, at the last minute, you all just kind of, will there be enough guys? Will there be enough girls? Will there be enough male dancers? Will there be enough female dancers to come in for the show? So you always are a little bit apprehensive. You're very excited because you're hoping that in your mind you have maybe two, three, maybe even four choices for a lead female and, and male role, and you're just hoping that someone will emerge. You've got to have something to work with and the people that show that kind of energy right off the bat and aren't afraid to act is, uh, is huge. First auditions I felt really prepared for and it was really fun to like watch other people and and like sort of compare. Uh, Mr. Halep is looking for can a person's be on pitch, can they can they sing obviously in tune, can they can they follow the music itself, the piano. Uh, do they have good projection? Those are those are standard things. Good night, ladies. Good night, ladies. We're going to leave you now. I had a feeling I was going to get a part, but I didn't think I was going to get a big part because I was trying out for the for the lead, and I screwed up the lead. I totally like was I was it was horrible. I fits the lady who knows what time it is this morning. The Saturn would watch her for me. Uh, Miss Shopee does a fabulous job of just giving uh, a specific dance routine for the guys and a specific dance routine for the girls. And we make everybody do it, whether they're going to dance in the show or not. And we try to see uh, how flexible somebody is. And it goes this way, step together, step, step together, step. Okay? I was really, really excited, but like my friends were all like kind of mad because I was like, guys, I want to be Zanita. And they're like, we're all trying it out for it too. And I'm like, eh. and then it like said dancing roll on the bottom and none of them take dance. So I was like, <laughs> Good for me, bad for them. We just learned our choreographed dance and it's going really well. Oh man, so totally good. Rock. And, oh, totally um, rock. <laughs> yay for music man! For sure, try yes. out. Except for, oh, it's already happened. It's all right. All I knew is I did the best that I could, but I was confident in myself. I didn't, I wasn't positive. I mean, I didn't think I was going to get the part, but I, I don't know. I was just, I knew I did as good as I could ever do. I couldn't have done any better. Of every shape and kind. Sounds like you both kind of have that. Did you guys want to, you need to do it again? Yeah. Sure. Okay. And then I'll let you go back. Well, this is my fourth day at the auditions. Four long days. But it's been fun and I'm excited to maybe make the play. I've had one callback for this and now I'm here for the barbershop quartet. As you can see, it's going to be good times. And I'm really excited and I really hope I get a roll. I didn't really have like any high goals about like oh I'm gonna make it into the play, and when I saw my name in there I was just, like really happy that like I made it and stuff. And but then at the same time I knew that there was gonna be so much work encompassed in being this one person with the barbershop quartet. But it was it worked out really well. It was really fun. So. <laughs>
we thought we had a strong cast, and we thought, okay, these are the people that we know we can work with. We, you know, it, there's still there's still some questions. You never know about who's going to react with what, but but uh, it was strong. I thought we did a, well, I mean, directors always feel that they do a good job of casting the show. Uh, it took us about three to five days to get the final list up there. We had some smaller callbacks. We had uh, certain people sing with one another, read with one another. We just wanted to see how the chemistry worked. We tried to take into consideration a lot of things. What's best for the show? If there's a senior involved, we try to do things like that where we can. And when we put the list up, we all felt that that was the very best list we could put up. Um, I will handle like leads and the, the subordinate oh, leads. What? What? Mr. Halp will actually go out and choose the chorus. Ms. Shalpi will go and put in her top choices for dancers, both male and female. And then we have to say, well, I need so-and-so over here and so-and-so over here. So sometimes there's a bit of trading going on. But once it gets posted, that's a hard one. That's a hard one because you think you've done the best job for the show. Uh, a lot of people are tremendously excited. Uh, others are not as excited, and some are just downright disappointed. Uh, Holy crap! A River oh City? God. Oh my Holy god! Holy crap! I got Tyler! I got Tyler! Tyler! We're still! Yeah! I feel good. Oh, I feel so good. Uh, oh, I feel so, oh, I feel so, oh, I feel so good. Uh. Sorry, that was really dumb. Did I think? No, I actually did not think I was going to get it at all. Yes! Ah! It was so cool. Like, it kind of took my breath away. Uh, but like, I was so like incredibly ecstatic. I was like jumping around and it was kind of surreal. Honestly, for like, it's still a surreal. Cause I'll be like, I was Zanita. At first it was like, it was just really exciting to know that I was gonna be the lead. And like finally, <laughs> I'm like a romantic lead. I was really angry because I wanted to be Mrs. Peru. <laughs> because she had songs and I didn't. And I was really jealous of Erica. And ironically, she wanted my part. So we were both a little angry and jealous of each other. But in the end, I decided that my part was what I was perfect for. And I had a lot of fun doing it.